Well, great afternoon. As you can see, I'm at the Sticks and Bricks, but I ordered a couple of good ones. Free van and RV camping on state public lands. And this one is Bureau of Land Management Camping. And both of them are set up very easily to use. It'll have a map and it'll have the areas and it'll tell you exactly what they are, um, how much they are, etc. Now the Bureau of Land Management Camping, those have some fees, some of them, uh, but this one is all free than an RV camping on state public lands. Um, so I'm glad to have these. Now I know where I live, where my sticks and bricks is, that they do have listed places out here that uh, I have stayed at a number of times. So it's good they do have them listed in here. Um, so looking forward to that. So why am I at my sticks and bricks? My car, you know, I just got the Prius. And all of a sudden, I took it out um, off-roading. And all of a sudden, it started making this horrible grinding sound. And it's, you know, um, metal on metal, just horrible. And I took it in. And uh, they're looking to find out what the heck was going on with it. Uh, so apparently, it's wheel bearings and... Uh, the uh, the thing that hooks into the wheel bearings, <laughs> I forget what they call it, but um, apparently that's what it is. All needs to be replaced. When I got something between my teeth, what the heck is that? <laughs> Sorry about that. But that needs to be replaced and the part doesn't come in until tomorrow. Now, the place where I'm getting it done, really nice guys there. Uh, they did the lift kit for me, and they actually gave me a ride home, and they will bring the car up when it's done and drop it off for me. So really, really nice guys to do that. Usually, they don't do that. They don't have a, you know, they don't have a customer service like that. But uh, they were nice enough to, to extend that to me, which I really appreciate. Um, you know, very honest guys. And so hopefully that's it. There's one other thing it could be, which is a big job. Um, and I can't remember the name of what it is. It's the... Um, it, it, it would be something you have to take out the transmission and everything. So hopefully it is just the wheel bearings and this other um, arm that hooks into it that that's the problem. So hopefully that fixes it. Um, so tomorrow they will get that part in and get that replaced and then give me a call and bring the car up to me. So very, very nice people. And then, <laughs> if that takes care of it, <laughs> I'll be able to be out and on the road and everything. But, you know, uh, I'm glad that it happened here and I wasn't you know, somewhere else in another state or someplace. Thank goodness it happened here and I was able to take it down there to get it repaired. So I just see that as grace that if it's going to go out, that it goes out here. Now, you know, I recently got the car. I don't even have it registered yet. Um, and it's got uh, 60,000 miles on it. So, you know, there's going to be some things that, of course, have to be repaired, etc. cetera. Um, but once all that gets done, it, it will be a very good vehicle. So I'm really happy, you know, with the car. Uh, I, I'm very happy with it. I'm happy I got the lift kit on it and everything and the tires that I had put on it. I'm really happy with those. 
Uh, and hopefully, like I said, this takes care of what's going on. Now, they said that they think the wheel bearings were going out, and I did take it off-road to test everything, and it was pretty, you know, it was a, <laughs> had big rocks like this, <laughs> you think, hey, that I'm going over, and he said the wheel bearings were um, ready to go out, and I hit that, and that, you know, that that did it, okay? So, um, like I said, I'm glad that I took it out and off-roaded, and they went out before I'm out somewhere, uh, really far out somewhere off-roading, and then I would have had the problem. Then, then it could have been uh, difficult, okay? Um, so, thank goodness that it happened here, and I decided to take it off-road and test it out. Uh, so, again... Um, you know, I could whine and cry and why did this happen, but I look at it as grace that it happened where it did and that I happened to get a hold of good mechanics that are fair, um, that I found them. So, you know, I just count it all as grace at this point. So on that note, I'll leave that here. And I'm looking forward to more adventures, but I, I just wanted to pass this along. If you're someone that's boondocking, you know, you're doing the Prius lifestyle or, or whatever car that you're in or van that you're in, and you want to do more um, off-road things or state lands, things like that, dispersed camping, uh, these you can get on Amazon, and uh, I think they're going to be well worth it for sure. Uh, because, you know, sometimes finding places is a bit difficult. So, anyway, uh, since, since I have the difficulty that I'm getting that fixed, I had time to be home to get these delivered. So, I'm happy with that, <laughs> you know. Count your blessings, you know. Find the good what you can in whatever situation that it is, okay? So on that note, I'll leave that here, and we'll see you online.